Hey, this is Asha and welcome to another inside day here at BSI and what I want to do today is uh, go ahead and sign up for a virtual phone system and uh, one of the reasons that I want to do that is uh, to go ahead and kind of mask my hidden number um, or one of my uh, other hidden numbers because typically what I do right now is we use kind of a like a local number that I've had for a while uh, but in order to kind of also route things to other team members, um, it's kind of nice to have a phone system. So, for example, right now when people call us in, it either go goes directly to me or unless someone is logged in on our Skype platform, then it, they may pick it up. So basically the way that we do it um, is um, if we have a Skype phone number right now, this is uh, the way that it works, is... I went ahead and I've had a Skype phone number. So you go ahead and get a Skype phone number. Um, and then when you get a Skype number, you basically give that out. And let's say we got one at the US. Uh, so here you can get a Skype phone number and then go ahead and uh, give that phone number out and then people will call you. So right now what happens is my team members have to log into Skype and then we might be all on the same Skype account and then we're answering phone numbers. So it's a little bit, um, a little bit different. So you could choose anywhere you want a location. So let's say, hey, I want a California number. And this is the way that typically people do it. If you, let's say, live in India and you want a phone number in California to seem like more of a tech company, uh, then you can do that. If you want one more in the New York area, I could go ahead and do that and say, hey, I want a 518 number. So that's one way to do it. And that's the way we've kind of been doing it. But uh, then it, once you start to route things a little more and you want, hey, you want a tech guy to answer the tech calls, you want a customer support person to answer the customer support, or let's say you have two or three websites and you got two or three numbers, well, it's a little more difficult to do that with Skype. So in either case, Skype's very good and uh, affordable. Uh, but I started comparing things between Mighty Call, Grasshopper, and also Fresh Call. Uh, one of the disadvantages for us or based on my needs is basically when we run a company, we have multiple websites, we have other websites that are popping up uh, since we have kind of a network and a uh, kind of different websites are working together. Uh, the problem here is, is when we have a one agent per month and plus pay per minute, well, I might have 15 or 25 agents because I might have one person in charge of the ebook stuff, one person in charge of the investing stuff uh, for customer support uh, because they have different specialties and, and knowledge and know-how. So if you have like 20 agents, this starts to add up very quick, even though they might be only answering like five calls a month. Uh, you know, so if a website is just getting started, it's not going to have a lot of phone calls. So then, you know, you look at Grasshopper Hopper as well. You have a solo plan or three number extension. So if you have three numbers that could give you like three websites, but only six extensions. So you got six people in theory, uh, maybe three numbers. Um, that gives you $44 on the plan. If you just do one number with three extensions, that's kind of three people. So one phone number would be almost one website or you're reusing that number across multiple websites. So it's a little more difficult. So if you have five numbers, this is kind of interesting, but you're paying $80 a month. So let's say I had five different websites. That way, hey, it's coming into this website. Then we know that it could get moved around that way. The number could bounce. Uh, but then I went and found Mighty Call as well. Uh, Mighty Call seems to fit our needs better um, just because, hey, you get unlimited extensions here when you compare it kind of to the solo plan and you get two phone numbers right away. So let's say, hey, I have uh, two websites. Well, right away, if you had two websites, you could put one number on one, one on the other, and now you have these extensions that you could forward them uh, here and there. The other advantage here is international calls. Uh, this is kind of per request, whereas this one and international numbers is kind of important for me in case uh, we deal with more international things in the future. Uh, but in either case, we're going to go ahead and sign up here with Mighty Call. There's also a coupon thing, but you know, for a coupon for $19.99 and then you get 50% off, $10 for the month to test it out uh, is a fairly reasonable kind of test. And this is kind of why we went ahead and this is what I'm aiming for. So in order to kind of sign up to this, we'll just go ahead and hit the sign up. I already kind of figured out the number I want. So here's, we're just going to use this tab. We'll go ahead and hit create an account. Uh, there's a promo code right there. So there you go. You can see, boom, I popped in the uh, uh, promo code. Uh, we'll go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and hide some of these uh, numbers here because of uh, the cell phone. So I'll move this a little off screen as I do the registration. Uh, 
and then we'll do the email and I'll add a little password here as well. So uh, once I have this kind of set up, uh, it'll take you to a pay by card area. So you're going to get kind of a form like this. There's kind of the number that you get. Uh, of course, you could kind of edit this if you want, if you want a different number. Uh, but let me see if I can just go back. There we go. It keeps that number. So I think that's fine. One eight 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 three five nine six four five four. Uh, so we'll pop in the credit card number here right now. All right. So then you kind of get this congratulations page with some of the uh, other details underneath, which I've kind of hidden. So that's pretty much it. And that's all you really need in order to go ahead and sign up for uh, something like this. Uh, to be able to go ahead and now use a 1-800 number on your websites and start routing calls to either other teammates, team members, or yourself. All right, so this is kind of why I went with Mighty Call because here you really have this flow chart that you can work with. So let's say, hey, you're not in a do not disturb, then what you can have is uh, move the calls there. If you're busy, then hey, here's kind of the, the next list. Uh, so you kind of have these answering rules that you can kind of create and set up. Um, and all these are customizable. Uh, just a quick look inside the panel. Here's kind of a, a little uh, phone widget that pops up that you can use to make uh, phone calls over here. It takes a few seconds there to, to come up, but um, there you can see there's your number. You go ahead, dial it in, make a call. Uh, activities. Let's take a look here. This looks like there's no activities yet. Probably some phone calls here that'll start coming in. You have some history of all the calls that were done. You can probably uh, buy to record some more uh, phone calls. I don't really need to record phone calls. You can see it set up kind of a, a team account here. Uh, there's kind of a forwarding number so you can forward it to your cell phone uh, right there. Uh, you could also add another person. So let's say, hey, I have another team member out there and I can go ahead and add them an extension. Uh, here's kind of another interesting part that I've liked is the call flow. So go ahead anytime there's a call right here, US and Canada, uh, you know, anytime there's there's basically a, a call there, you go ahead from any customer at all 24 hours a day. You could go ahead and have business hours if you want, which is kind of cool. If you want available 24 hours a day, just forward it there. And then there's kind of like a, a greeting and so forth if you don't pick it up. Uh, and then it forwards it to uh, to me. Uh, you could go ahead and change this. I could go ahead and add a team member. I could go ahead and dial by the name. I could go ahead and leave a voicemail. I could add music. So you could go ahead and really create a fairly significant flow. I could enable VIP. So if uh, let's say a number comes in from, let's say this number, um, and now from a VIP customer right there, it goes and forwards it to here and I could have it go to a different extension. So it's kind of interesting that, hey, if you have a call coming in from a certain person, it forwards it to another extension and you could go ahead and stack this to many more uh, things. So it looks like you can even uh, add a, a, a flow um, and so forth. So let's say, hey, we save changes. I could go ahead and create another flow. So here's kind of the default flow. I could create a new flow and another flow. So you could have multiple flows there working together seamlessly, filtering calls based on your needs. We don't need things that complicated, but hey, if your business does a lot of call related volume, um, then you may want something like this. For us, we're just looking for basic phone support. People can't reset their password. It might be basic questions. It might be kind of all these phone calls are really all about. But again, it's always nice to reach people in another way. So anyways, uh, that's um, the Mighty Call panel and system. Uh, if they have an affiliate uh, link, I'll go ahead and link that in the description on the website or check out the resources page uh, on our website. And that way you can go ahead and get linked up, maybe get a discount as well. Uh, for watching the video and uh, get yourself situated and get a 1-800 number and start flowing and routing your calls based on your needs and for your customers. All right, so thank you so much for joining me in this video. I hope you found it helpful. And if you do and you want to stay up to date, uh, then be sure to get on the newsletter list. Click the link here, enter your name and email address when you're there, and I'll send you the newsletters as new videos are released, along with any other goodies, free books that I write, uh, courses that are created, so that way you can go ahead and ramp up your business to that next level. All right, thanks again, and I'll see you next time.